A lot of lies were being spouted, especially on the economic issues. And this was a way of intimidating people into voting to stay in the EU. Catherine McBride is an economist. She spent her life studying and analysing financial markets and economies. Her experience and breadth of knowledge enables her to authoritatively overturn many of the myths and misrepresentations about the impacts of Brexit on the UK. The idea that everyone will move to Frankfurt is nonsense. It is complete nonsense. More people work in finance in the UK than there are people in Frankfurt. The UK market supplies 90% of wholesale financial services to the EU. We insure planes, insure engines, we insure contracts, we do catastrophe insurance, hurricane insurance, things that no one else insures, the London market insures. Who else are they going to use? Or are they just going to live without financing and live without foreign exchange and live without derivatives and live without commodity trading and all of the things we supply them with? The UK economy will be fine when we leave the EU. We will continue to buy German cars and the Germans will continue to buy financial services from the UK because neither have a competing industry themselves. One of the reasons that I really do not believe that no deal will be a disaster is because I am one of the survivors who has already lived through no deal. When I was a teenager, Australia was dumped by the UK uh, with no deal and we survived. In fact, we thrived. It was probably the best thing the UK ever did to us. We do not import anywhere near as much food as people think. Most of the base product of food, we supply 80% of our own beef, we supply 90% of our own chicken, we supply 100% of our own lamb and 100% of our own dairy. There have been all sorts of scare stories about us running out of medicine. This is also false. The UK actually sells more boxes of medicine to the EU than we buy from the EU. There's a whole lot of misinformation out there, all blamed on Brexit. The rest of the world is developing. The rest of the world has money to spend. Jump out and embrace the rest of the world. It is where it's all happening right now.